A recent video on social media has gone viral and caused quite a debate. That's that video of a four-year-old boy who got into a gorilla enclosure at the Cincinnati Zoo. The zoo shot the gorilla to save the boy. Many people, though, have criticized the zoo's decision, saying they were wrong. Local News 8's Misty England spoke to a local zoo today to get their thoughts on situations like the one in Cincinnati. She joins us now from Zoo Idaho. So, Misty, what did the zoo there have to say? Jay, the zoo superintendent said that first and foremost, nobody can really judge what happened unless they were there in that situation. But he says from a zoo expert standpoint, he believes that the Cincinnati Zoo did what they had to. My professional feeling is the decision was right. The child's life took precedence. While Pruitt agrees with the zoo's decision, others disagree. Many on social media have stated the zoo should have just tranquilized the animal, but Pruitt says that would have been the wrong decision. It can take 10 to 30 minutes for a tranquilizer to kick in. Plus, it could have upset the gorilla, putting both the animal and the child in even more danger. Pruitt says Zoo Idaho has written procedures in place for emergencies like this, especially for big animals they have like the grizzlies. He says all of the staff are regularly trained in the procedures, but he says people need to understand the zoo's responsibility. Priority, of course, will always be our guest's life, then it's zookeeper life, then it's animal life. So, you know, people have to understand, even though this gorilla is endangered, and there are a lot of dangerous animals that are endangered, human life still takes precedence. Pruitt says that currently the zoo has a code red policy, meaning that a dangerous animal has escaped. They also have a code purple, which means that there has been a dangerous animal attack or injury. Pruitt says that the zoo always has a response team on standby for any type of emergency situation. Live from Zoo Idaho, I'm Misty Inglet. All right, that's comforting to know that. Thanks, Misty. Pruitt says he would also like to remind the public to be careful when at the zoo. He says while accidents like this one do happen, it's a good reminder of why people need to be careful.